Hi YouTube, James Baker CPA here and today I have it's just a helpful video. Uh, I make a lot of videos for people who want to do their own stuff and that's why I'm on here to educate you guys. And today I want to just share the numbers to call the IRS. IRS. So here it is. Here's a bunch of phone numbers you can use. I have it saved as call the IRS. This is a service and don't I know the lot of I'm not going to go into too much detail, but I'm on the hold of the IRS now. Can you hear it? So I'm going to leave that over here. And I basically want to um, share this with you. The IRS general line is for people who have 1040s. The practice uh, practitioner priority service lines are for licensed professionals like myself. If you're a regular person, you don't really call those lines. You would call the general line. The e-help desk is really great for, um, you know, fixing technical issues, logging into your back end, anything with the IRS uh, on there. If you owe the IRS money, you would call the automated collection system for individuals or business. If you have to uh, verify your identity for something, they have a ver identity verification line. If you have a lien on one of your properties because you owe taxes, this is the number here. Um, this is the offer and compromise line for if you have an offer and compromise that's pending and that's if you owe taxes and you're broke and you don't can't pay your taxes. So that, that works out. SBA loan, I never called that line for them. Tax exempt line, I'm, I'm presuming I've never called this either. It's for tax exempt entities. If you owe payroll taxes and that's with U.S. employees, you would call this number. Um, if you have correspondence examination in your business, you're dealing with that, you call that number. And then the last one, probably the most common one that you guys are going to use is the IRS EIN help number. I don't know if that's what it's called. That's what I call it. And it wasn't even on this list. So I'm adding it to the list. And this is going to be how you call to get your EIN number. Uh, or if you lost your EIN number, if you sent an SS4 and you didn't get the number back, uh, then that's the number you're going to call. You can pause the video and come back to this. Um, actually, I've had it up the whole time. So, you know, if you if you thought this was helpful, I'm not going to go into too much more detail. These are the numbers. If you need to call the IRS, call them. I thought I'd just make this quick video for you, how to call the IRS, all phone numbers. And uh, I thought I'd make this video for you. So if it's helpful, thumbs up, subscribe. I have a lot of other information that's useful, entertaining, and interesting. Uh, and I appreciate you guys being here, supporting small businesses. I do the same. Like, subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next video. I hope this was helpful. Comment if I missed a number, too.